our story started about 10 years ago when we began cycle testing our 250 kilogram mega unit in Italy. Over that past decade, we put over 5,000 cycles on the unit, which is the equivalent of daily cycles of almost 14 years. Our confidence in the product stems from the fact that over those 5,000 cycles, we have yet to experience even a half of 1% in performance degradation. So we are very excited about bringing this technology to microgrids and where hydrogen energy storage is needed to accelerate the adoption of clean energy. Our metal hydride is a titanium iron alloy. Unlike other metal hydride technologies on the market, um, ours is, does not have magnesium. So it represents the safest form of hydrogen storage and it operates at low pressure and temperature. How it works is very simple. Hydrogen is fed to the storage vessels holding the alloy, perhaps directly from a PEM electrolyzer at 30 bar. The alloy absorbs the hydrogen and generates a small amount of heat at 20 degrees C as the chemical reaction occurs. The vessels have a coolant jacket that our thermal management system uses to draw heat out of the hydride. At that point, the hydrogen is locked in solid form indefinitely without losses. Unlike a battery, if you come back a year from now, the same amount of energy is still available in the hydride. When you want the hydrogen to come out, heat between 60 degrees and 90 degrees C is fed from our thermal management system. Uh, you can either use on-site byproduct heat or electricity to heat the coolant. It requires about four kilowatt hours uh, per kilogram to desorb the hydrogen. So the round trip efficiency using electricity is about 88%. And using byproduct heat, the efficiency is about 